What's a man got to do to get that kind of attention from you? It's hard to say exactly, but you seem to be doing fine. Well, great. Though truth is, it ain't me that wants you. Oh? No, Miss Jacqueline Natler does, from Natler Technologies. You know, creator of all things bright and beautiful. <laughs> Seal it, Larson. Ma'am. Feast your eyes on this, Laura. How does that make your wallet rumble? I'm sorry. I only play for sport. Then you'll like a big park. Peru. Vast mountain ranges to cover. Sheer walls of ice. Rocky crags. Savage winds. And there's this little trinket. An age-old artifact of mystical powers buried in the unfound tomb of Qualapec. That's my interest. You could leave tomorrow. Are you busy tomorrow? You just pulled the tough end of a wishbone. Howdy. Afternoon. Left Larson sucking wind then, eh? If that is the phrase. Well, your little vacation riot's over now. Time to give back what you've hijacked off me. Let's try the lunchbox. <clears throat> well? Let's go. <laughs> 
I'm going back inside. You coming? You can't do this. We condemn you, Nakla of Atlantis, for your crimes, for the flagrant misuse of your powers, and for robbing us of our... You can't, I... Breaking the three bond of consent that our people are ruled and secured under, and invading Teopan and myself with our army, our warriors, empty from our pyramid, so that you can use the pyramid. It's powers of creation for your own mindless destruction. Mindless? Look at you! Neither of you have one squirt of inventive juice in your heads. Wasters. Let's just do it. Tihokan! You use the sacramental place as a source of individual pleasure. As some freak factory. They're survivalists, a new generation. A slaughter heap now. And you. We're gonna lock you in limbo. Make your veins, heart, feet, and that diseased brain stick solid with frozen blood. Greet your eternal unrest, Natla! You won't rest either, or your damned continent! Located now to St. Francis's folly, new temptations torment me. Rumor amongst my fellow, fellow brothers is that entombed beneath our monastery is the body of Tiokan, one of the three legendary rulers of the lost continent Atlantis, and that with him lies his piece of the Atlantean scion, a pendant divided and shared between the three rulers, which curbs tremendous powers. Powers beyond the Creator himself, my toes sweat at such possibilities, lying so close to my mortal self. Each night, I beat myself rid of these fantasies, but it is indeed a test. Pierre, you litterbug. <laughs> 